Hi, it's Coach Garcia again. Um, I'm just going to talk to you guys a little bit also about what sexual harassment really is and what it can be because sometimes people think in their head that when they th hear sexual harassment they think automatically the most extreme terrible um, sexual acts in their head that they would probably never commit or they've never experienced and so they, th they think well I've never um, committed sexual harassment, never, that's never happened to me or I've never witnessed it when in reality you probably have had some experience with it um, and so basically it's it's not always as extreme as you might think it can start really small and uh, basically I've seen a lot of students think that the comments that they make to one another um, or to someone else are not inappropriate or they're not sexual but if it has to do with their physical body in any way that can be deemed as sexual harassment so um, especially if you're gonna make a comment to someone that you really don't have a strong relationship with if you're gonna talk about their body and especially the opposite sex whether it's a female towards a male or a male towards a female if you're gonna talk about their physical body you've got to be very careful I would almost just never make any comment about someone's body because um, it can be taken in the wrong way and you not you might have some negative uh, motivation behind what you're saying and if they pick up on that um, then you're, you're stepping into that sexual harassment bound so don't always think it has to do with committing a terrible sexual act that you're, you're getting to something completely different and that's even worse but we're, we're just talking about sexual harassment and in the workplace or in school or the social area wherever you hang out and if it's anything to do with a person's whether uh, like you heard before whether it's a comment or a look even towards that person's physicality then you're risking getting into sexual harassment but that that does don't get that confused with uh, complimenting someone's uh, strengths or um, talking about someone's clothes in, in an appropriate kind way th those things are fine th we encourage those things but once you start getting into talking about someone's negative uh, or negatively talking about someone's physical appearance or anything to do with them sexually then you're crossing that boundary